Exact Track 4D constantly scans for new threats in your neighborhood, alerting you faster than ever when severe storms are heading your way. Well, Janice, it looks like I think spring is finally here. We're full <laughs> into the hot weather time of year. Yeah, it's definitely a Florida spring, yeah. though. We're, we're in these hot temperatures. In fact, the temperatures reach 90 this afternoon oh, for yeah. us here in Jacksonville. And we're actually above our average temperature. Typically, we're in the low to mid 80s around this time. So 90, though we love it, it's a little bit of above average. And take a look at our sky cam right now as well. As you can see, we're also dealing with 91 degrees. This is in Clay County at Doctors Lake Marina, where so many people have been taking advantage of the fact that they have a boat and they can enjoy themselves out on the river or in the ocean. So it's pretty nice there. Wind coming from the west, 13 miles of, per hour, which is a nice breeze to have with so much heat. A little bit of cloud coverage coming in though as well. But as you can see, the parking lot is packed from boaters that are at the marina right now. Also taking a look at the beaches, our Guy Harvey Resort Sky Cam. 80 degrees, quite the contrast if you're at the coast, if you're on the coast closer to the ocean versus seeing Doctors Lake Marina, which is further inland, even though you still have the river to give you a little bit of a cool down, it's not doing much in contrast. So as you can see, with the winds coming from the south southeast at eight miles per hour in St. Augustine, we do have a moderate rip current risk from Fernandina Beach all the way down to Flagler Beach. Please keep in mind that the height of those waves is at about two feet. And overall, taking a look at exact track 4D radar right now, we don't have anything to track from southeast Georgia to northeast Florida, but there is a stationary front that is in more so central Georgia, making its way towards Jessup, Hinesville area. And they even had a severe thunderstorm warning earlier as I was tracking this particular cell of a storm to see if it would have any impact on us as we get into the evening hours. After sunset, southeast Georgia, you could see some rain this evening going all the way through midnight. And I'll talk about that in just a moment. First, looking at your temperatures, Southeast Georgia, good evening to you, Meridian, you're at 81, as well as St. Simon at eight, 83, rather, for Meridian, St. Simon at 81, Kingsland 88, Folkestone, you're at 86, as well as Blackshire, Jessup, and Waycross, and also Homerville going south into northeast Florida. You can see the temperatures also very warm here for us. St. Augustine at 80, Keystone Heights and Palaka, you're at 86. And then we have 88 degrees for Hawthorne, 86 for Lake City as well as Gainesville. So overall, those winds again coming from the southeast in this area, below 10 miles per hour along the coast, a little slower further inland. And then Gainesville getting their impact of the wind coming from the Gulf at 14 miles per hour. But we do have the possibility for rain this evening. We'll have the cloud coverage come in around sunset and then going into the evening hours there is the chance for some rain but it's more so focused in southeast georgia and it may even be north of our counties such as glenn and ware counties north of that area as well in georgia but it is possible tonight we're going to dip into the 60s and then we'll warm right back up tomorrow morning so see as we take the dip we get down to about 70 after midnight around 2 a.m get into the mid 60s just before the sun rises and as you look at the plan you see here in the evening will be in the 60s and 70s in the morning in the mid 60s the afternoon tomorrow the chance for rains 20 percent will be breezy and gusty in the 80s in the evening we will see some rain and then again that will continue into sunday evening we do have a chance for rain tomorrow and also for monday 50 percent tomorrow 40 percent on monday here's a look at your temperature for tonight going into the early morning hours 64 degrees partly cloudy skies and again rain chances for sunday and Monday. Download the Weather Authority apps. So you know what's happening weather-wise no matter where you are and enjoy that warm weather tonight.